Hello and welcome to my factorial let's play season 2 episode 4. Today we are going to be working on research labs and setting a well half decent research lab up that we won't need to change later on in late game. So I believe I've got everything ready and as of last time if you guys didn't see I set um, what do I call it? The red science pack and green science pack up which is pretty nifty now, it's all working the only change I've made to this is I've reduced the amount of uh, power poles I used, it was just friggin everywhere and I just changed the conveyor belt heading back this way because the research lab we are going to put in here so what we can do is if we grab these research labs, if we place them down I'll grab half a dozen, eight, eight should do so if we go one, two, and can I get closer? Mm, no. Nah. Three and four. And if we go one and just place it. Oh crap. Didn't sound well. Right, now we've placed them down. Now what we can do is we can head back over to here. And what we can do is we want to grab our underground conveyor belts, place these bad boys down, place one there, and probably one there. Next, what we're going to want to do is basically we're going to make a ring circle all the way around these um, labs. So if we go, make sure you leave a space because you're going to need that and now if we and leave the edges just for a sec and why am I always standing on the conveyor belt when I place it down it's not a good start I, <laughs> hmm, I may actually run out of conveyor belts oh well Now, if we head back up top, we can place the last of these down. And just to make it a bit more smoother, we will place fast conveyor belts in each of the corners. So, hopefully, we won't notice it as much lag or slowness. Especially when we get later in the game. Saves doing it now. Less work you have to do later just like so now what I think we'll do is we'll get another underground four and we'll see if this will work connect these guys up now all we've got to do is connect them up There you go. As you can see, it's processing again, so it's a basic setup. Now, what we're going to want to do, okay. Hmm, how are we going to fix that? Okay. Right. Alrighty, so what I think we'll do to fix that is we'll actually turn it out because I want to use both sides of the conveyor belt maximum efficiency so what I will do is I'll break some of this and I think we'll bring the conveyor belts um, spin it around just up to here so now if we spin that guy like that and then like that there we go we let them roll around and now we have both sides working so what we can do is we can grab our fast inserters because I love blue inserters, blue is a great colour and it just works place one like so each research lab spin these bad boys round if you want to use normal inserters you can, it's totally up to you So. 
Now we're gonna need power. And lucky enough, we have some power poles. Even better. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Definitely gonna need some more better ones than these baby mamas. Let's replace these. One here. Okay. Place one there. One there. One there. And one there. And vice versa for the same for the other side. If I cannot, every time it happens to me, I keep going around on the conveyor belt. Right, there we go. So, now we've got that research lab set up. What should we research? I think we will research. So we can do a bit of steel production. I think that's in order. So what, we need 50 of them. What about for the mm, same? I reckon we'll go for the, yeah, the research them bad boys. And while we're waiting for that, we're going to need some stone soon. So if we head over and get some stone, I've actually got a, a miner ready. Place that out. Now I'll grab the small one, the quicker one, because I like it going quick on the corner. And just for now, we'll use a basic furnace. Place that guy there. Right, aha. Our chest. We'll place that over there. Always too close. Just there. Now, do we have a couple more inserters? Okay. Anyway, we're going to need to get some coal. So, once I've got this, we can carry on. To grab the coal. Do I have any more inserters in my junk chest over here? No, I don't. Well, we only need one, a normal inserter should do. So if we head back or head back over there. Running so slow. And yet yeah, nothing's happened yet. So grab the coal, the 50 coal in there. 50 is better than none. Just to get it started. We can use this guy. actually one more inserter so yes okay now we've got that other inserter we can place it next to the chest and set this bad boy up and you want to place him that way now we're going to need to set some power so where is the closest power line here so we're going to want to make this look neat so place that guy there just for now, I have a straight line running like an L shape. And and now down we go. Oh, how about that? Oh, bang in line. Place it. Oh, water. So unfair. And last but not least, one over here. There you go. Our research is finished, plus, we're getting some stone. Wicked. So it goes to prove that our. Oh, there you go. Our factory's working like nobody's business. So, yes, we press T. Now, if we research, we'll research these power poles because we're going to need some more. The better ones, let them go. Yes. Fantastic. So, let's see if we can craft a couple of these guys. Okay, 
we're going to need some steel. So, if we quickly grab... Do I have... Oh, I have 70 of them. Even better. So now we head up to our two furnaces that are left over here. Chuck seven in there and we'll let them craft. And then hopefully in the next episode we can get going on a steel factory. Probably somewhere where I'm standing. And then we can pipe it out to make some cool snazzy stuff. Oh, and just as a recap, this is easily expandable. All you have to do is take out this bottom conveyor belt, this bit here, and then just expand it down. So yeah, you can keep going with this one, and eventually we'll, we will have the blue science, and alien tech science come into this slot as well, on a second, on another plan I have. So that's the plan, so until next time, sit tight.